Hi there and welcome back, dear friends and deep thinkers, to Wizardry 8 and uh, we're continuing our walk through Anika where we visit all the shops and uh, we will someone free here? someone today. We tried to do it yes, uh, yesterday, well, the day before, uh, but we had really, really big fights coming into our way. And on the one hand, that is really exciting. On the other hand, um, you really don't want to don't want to do this. We have shopped a little bit, so we've got a book of healing. So our First bishop class. can now also learn healing, and so one more guy to heal. Always a good help. Let's heal our fighter to the fullest and. Out there. Let's see how is the buffs. Yeah, we could use a little bit of missile shield again. And now. Too heli. Uh, no, not too heli. To Vi Domina. There's also something hidden here. Pling! So let's get in here and free our friend some copper gloves that are also not bad eight armor class perfect here they're very heavy so you only give them something. to strength based people anyways there's a poignard that's an even better dagger one to eight and plus hit to hit plus one so that's really good uh, we can give that thing to Miles for now. Oh, look at her. Yeah, she, she got the shiller luck. It's pretty great. And I continue here. A damaged black box that will be important later on. Mm, looking around here, there's nothing to find. But there is a door. The chase begins. Attack! We have five Savant Troopers. Savant Troopers are pride quite strong, as you can see here. But we're not afraid. Let's see what we should do. Oh, we could we could start with a bless. Right then. And then we can go piercing pipes. Okay. Mm. And I think we're going to wait okay. until they come to us. And there is our friend Vi Domina that we want to free. So the advantage now is that, okay, we have Miles going first. Then we should get Bless and then uh, Piercing Pipes. Here we go. And Vi Domina gets that as well. Which is the big advantage. To wait a tad until she comes into view. One of them down. Wow, 11 damage. Hardcore. Right then. I'm gonna energy blast them. And piercing pipe okay. again. It's against four, it's fine. Gonna wait, so... We get the best attacks in, and not the ranged ones. Here we go. Wow! Great damage. We're doing already... You can see the strength of this party. They start out a little bit slow the first five levels, but then it gets way better. And I think we can now just go for it. Oh, oh, is anyone coming towards us? Yes. The damaged guy. Ah, oh, bless has expired. We'll re-bless ourselves. Here we go. Right then. And then we'll walk in. And they're pretty much... Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, we got another one guy. Here. Here we go. Rebless. 
I mean, why Domina is pretty sturdy, so... It's usually all good, and now we can... Go further in. We win, naturally. Good stuff. A lot of skill ups for Emmanuel. This thing. Pretty important, the hinged box. And hello there. Finally. Oh, thank God it's you. Uh, whoever you are. I was expecting the Dark Savant. And no offense, but you look like a bunch of schoolgirls compared to him. His troopers locked me up in here. And I was expecting him any minute. And we've already had one run in too many. Say, let's get out of here before he comes looking for me. Oh, and I haven't even introduced myself. My name's Vitalia, but you can call me Vi. Gives us 500 gold and 7,000 experience. More in this for us. <coughs> hmm. Let's take her where she wants to go. Sometimes you have to wait for the payoff, if you know what I mean. Yeah, but we can talk to her a little bit and we'll do that. Do we know anything about Anselm? Well, we do have a lot of stuff to do. Okay, maybe the Destiny Dominus. It's our most sacred object. Funzang himself gave it to the Hegadi, so you can imagine why everyone was so ticked off when Martin stole it. The monks believe it represents all the gods' knowledge. If we could understand it, if we could find it, well, I guess we'd almost be cosmic lords ourselves. She's got a pretty cool eye here. She's one of the uh, recruitable RPCs that go to nearly every area. There's some that will not go to all the areas, or most of them go, go to very few areas. Why Domina is the one, if you recruit her, she will stay with you for most of the areas and, of course, to the final. So you, you try to take her along all the time. Do you know anything about the some henchmen? of the Dark Savant. Really, they're just machines, you know. But they're programmed to do his bidding. And you can be sure it's not good. Yeah, the Dark Savant, by the way. If you don't know who he is, you will soon enough. I met him when I was young, barely 20. He was visiting Dominus on some diplomatic mission, or so he said. He was nice, you know, interesting in a fatherly sort of way. He asked me if I wanted to take a ride, tour the galaxy in style, and I thought, what's the harm? It took me almost seven years to get back home. The longest seven years of my life. The fallout wasn't pretty. I mean, look what it did to my eye. What was my eye? Now he's back on Dominus, and who knows what he wants. Uh. I would have thought you know. What about the cosmic circle? You should ask about it at the temple. Okay. Um. Do you know in the MOOC? I don't know any more than you do. The Impani? They're one of the greatest trading cartels in the universe, and very powerful. Unless, of course, you ask the Trang, who will tell you that they're the most powerful. You know how that goes. What about the Trang? There isn't much that happens in the universe that the Trang don't have a hand in. Well, and the Umpani too. It seems the Trang and the Umpani are always at odds, even here on Dominus. What about Anika? So much to say about it. I grew up here, you know. It wasn't like this then, of course. I mean, it was an actual town with actual people. What's happened here really makes me hate the Dark Savant. Him and that stupid tower. Yeah, what about the tower? That tower destroyed part of Annika, part of my history. What was he thinking? That he can just do as he pleases? That tower is built on what used to be Annika. And I worry it's not just his place to stay here. I believe it has a far more sinister purpose. Oh, and what purpose? Yes, exactly. Okay. Ah. Uh... So the Trang. There isn't much that happens in the universe that the Trang don't have a hand in. Well, and the Umpani too. It seems the Trang and the Umpani are always at odds, even here on Dominus. Okay, how are you? I'm all right, thanks. Any rumors? If I hear anything, trust me, 
I'll tell you. Okay, tell me about Stick yourself. Around, and you'll learn all you need to know about me. And about Martin. I remember hearing about him. He stole the Destiny Dominus from the monastery. It was way before my time. They chased him through Trenton. Martin's Bluff, that's how it got its name. And who knows where else. <laughs> they never did find him or the Destiny Dominus. And about... Well, we ah, do. no. About Miles. Miles? Miles. Who doesn't know Miles? And Helly? She told us about you. Helly? She's been running that bar in Arnica as long as I can remember. If you haven't already figured it out yourself, Helly's the one you talk to if you want to know the word on the street. Cool, cool, cool. Cool talking. talking. Now, will you come along? Let's go. Splodded. I become even more deadly. Good Geronimo. Troopers really did a number on me. I was planning to visit some friends before they grabbed me. Maybe we could go together. I was hoping to see Helly at her bar or Lord Braffitt in the temple. I don't care which we go to first. Okay, Helly or Lord Braffitt. We can do that, but now. First, uh, leveling up a bit. Want to save these picks again? Scout and do some mythology. And I think we're, we're kind of good now. Let's see. Now there's something hidden in one of the houses that I I want to get before we before we forget okay. about it. Oh, look at that! Yeah, there's a lot of stuff hidden there. There's something special where we can make our first gadget, which is of course pretty exciting. Locked up. Ah uh, no! Oh no! Um, here, here we go. Well, always be careful. Nothing much here much here what about the books nothing of interest so uh, yeah I mean some of the houses are empty but in some there's really good thing for example here that oh I sense something moving I'm ready oh, God there's savant gunners now so they're ranged which means we should if we can charge in towards them we'll use our bard now oh, and we have to reposition because we don't want her to be on the front line she'll go to the middle for I now okay want her we want acdc to go for um angel's tongue uh, and i think we'll energy blast them right then and we want to run okay. in because as i've already said they are ranged creatures not that far of a range, but far enough that that's, it's a big disadvantage for them if we move forward towards them. Ouch. Ah, uh, yeah, see that? Already unconscious. Mm. So what can we do? Let's just go forward with it. Ow. A Higali patrol is on the other side, apparently. <coughs> and they will try to help us, so that's cool. If they come close enough, we might even bless them. That's why the rounds are taking so long. Sometimes the Higali patrol is moving. But I think we could have done this also on our own. Let's see. Right then. Here we go. Hey, hey. Thankfully, we've got the missile shield that blocks some of the attacks, even not many. Yeah, it's three extra guys. Or four, even. Most heads traveled in that one of them down. Next one. Right then. Right then. We can see here already that they can drain stamina, as you can see. They can also cause unconsciousness, and they're immune to disease, poison, nausea, irritation, fear, sleep. They don't have that many hit points. 
But they are very uh, resistant to, to magic damage. And especially to magic effects, if you, as you've seen. Guardi Patrol is a stun mace, so they are really elite patrols right now. Stun mace is pretty good. See what we can do? Ah, uh, hard to hit these guys. Go, go, go. Ow! What Geronimo is also unconscious now. And a kidna. Oh, gods. What's going on there? Thankfully, another one bites the dust. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should stay away a bit. Focus the damage. Um. A level of one, yeah, that's too low. Mm, do we have anything better? Maybe, maybe we'll try mine. That may acid splash, maybe. Right then, right then. Here we go. We'll just try that for now. Look at this, wonderful. <coughs> yeah, the special effects is what makes these so dangerous. We don't have like cure light condition, but hey. Right there. Now we have a front line again and we can move forward. Let's do that. And attack them. Or not. It's fine. Splendid victory. Wonderful. I think you best be treating me with a little more respect. Ah, my talents have been rewarded. Although it is pleasant to advance, true happiness comes only through meditation. Locked. Here. Yeah, let's close the door. I'm better now. We found what we wanted. Here we go. We've got the doll. And... Where's Savvy? We can combine now. The doll and the hinge right box. On. I've got the deck in the box, which is a terror spell. We're using engineering. It's pretty cool. And it's also pretty effective. There are way better things that you can get, but this is a good start. Uh, I get miles a little higher. As long as he can help us. <laughs> mm, yeah, daggers. Here we go. Good ninja too. Alchemy and uh, let's see what's what's going low. Critical strike, dual weapons. And Emmanuel. Hmm. It's getting a lot. It's getting a lot. Um, but nothing really essential here. Cure lesser condition would be really nice, but we'll get a book for that later on when we have money. Ha ha ha. Here we go. Mm. Artifacts and alchemy and yeah, divinity. Here we go. You bellowed. I'll heal up a bit. Yeah. 
You have summoned me? Doing well. Uh, we could rest a bit so we can buff up again. Let's see here our buffs. Uh, our buffer, Emmanuel, is a bit exhausted. You bellowed. Let's get the light going. For a long time. Missile shield. And the good enchanted blade. Biscuit. Ah. But now. Then we'll visit the other shops. Seal tight. Here. Anything hidden here? I mean, it's good practice. Look there. Aha! Book of lesser cures. What did I tell you? There's a book for that. First class. Empty bottles. You can make bombs and stuff from that. Nothing legible here. What's in here? Nothing more of interest. We'll not go yet to the tower. We'll rather visit, visit the rest of the shops so you can find out more about what you can acquire here. A lot of interesting things. If the shops is around here. And then we'll come to a shop that is led by someone who looks like a monster. We'll visit the harbor and at the harbor there's a shop. Uh, wait, wait. Right then. What will we do here? Mm. We'll wait for the piercing pipes to get ready. Also the lightning rod. We don't want them to run away. They're not really that strong, so okay. they can come closer. Yeah, not bad though. That's that's and you can see here first things from mythology air resistance 35, so don't attack them with air spells. It's not that effective. The Higali patrols are also coming. Charging in. Yeah, and we'll, we'll move in a little bit here, so we can also attack. Patrols helping us. Oh, can we not hit them just like that? No. Apparently not. Why not? We're... Pretty close to them. Oh well. Guess we'll just wait a bit. Right then. They'll come to us. We'll just ignore it. Will you guys come closer? No? No, they're actually throwing death stars, my goodness me. Ah, uh, they're advancing towards us. Now we have to try to move in again. I'm on it. Let's see. Two of these guys. The guardy patrols moving in. From the side. We've buffed them with a blessing. Uh, for some kind of reason we cannot attack these... Uh, in close combat? Even if we swap weapons? Oh, now it worked! 
Oh, no, have you seen that? It's just worked. Ah, it's because why is again at the front? Oh my goodness, why? Why? Okay, let's do it like that then. Take Here this. we go. Yeah, now you see the problem when, when someone is at the front line. The rest cannot really attack well. In the ranged way. Uh, now it's better. Here we go. Take this. Yeah, they weren't too too hard, and we get a lot of gold for for beating them. Um, what we want to do now is really take a look at why. She's got a bronze cuirass. That's good. Got no shoes. We can at least give her sandals or something. Even that is better than nothing. Leather leggings. The bronze cuirass. And she should really wear the all pike. It's, it's just better. And then she belongs into the middle where I've already said it's really good to have someone with an extended weapon in the middle. So we'll put her into the middle of it and it's pretty great. You have summoned me? So I've that didn't summoned. work out, but instead we got uh, skill ups, which is also great. Let's go quickly in here, pick a couple of things something up. Around. Right, there's something again. It's usually something lying around here. Huh? What a lonely guardy raider? <laughs> Did he run away or what? Looks there. We got some flash powder. Usually you also find a pothole here, but we don't. We, just, we seem to not do that. Okay. Okay. Right then. It Mind stab hidden. And he's a thinking and feeling creature, so let's just mind stab him. A little bit overconfident. A little bit very overconfident. And we got a Thieves Buckler. That's a very good shield, as you can see. Gives you t 10 speed and 10 locks and traps skill, which is just perfect for our bard. So, anyways, uh, needed in locks and traps. Let's see if anyone else needs a shield. Um, cannot give it to her, but here we go. Our bishop takes a shield. Looks there. And here we go. Where's the portal? Come on. Now let's go to the shop, as I've promised. It's just around the corner here. It's Anna's shop. Someone's here. Much about ranged weapons, and there's something in the back. Trapped. Yeah, it's it's her treasury. Here. And I mean, what good is this stuff for when it's just in the bank, right? So we'll um borrow this. Like a scatter trap. That's the key card that we'll need for our uh, robbing the bank plot. <laughs> <coughs> hey there, Anna. Well, look at you. I wondered when I'd get a chance to see you with my own eyes. <laughs> Aliens and all. 
Old Tremaine told me you was in town. Oh, he don't miss nothing. <laughs> Between me and him, we're probably the only two left with any wits about us. Everyone else has gone crazy since the tower showed up. Oh, but you didn't come here for my opinions, now did you? <laughs> Obviously, you've come to do a little shopping. Shopping. <laughs> yeah, Miss Mary Shoppins. Um, we've, we've come here for shopping, but what about... Braffin. Brotherhood of the Ascension. He's the local leader, I guess you might say. Ah, okay. Your and brain wet, brother. Yeah. Harry Helly. runs her own bar. Nice woman. So she hasn't also lost her wits about Miles. Miles? Ah, oh, well, what's to say about Miles that ain't already? Okay, rumors. I listen to as many as I can. Okay, and how are you? Better. Yeah, there's not much to talk. Uh, to her about. I mean, we can ask her about the party or something. You mean things with the horn sticking out where her nose should be? <laughs> I can't make no sense of them. You might ask Kelly. She gets around. Uh, uh, not that way. You know what I mean. And the book? What's it worth to you? Aha, you know something. Okay, here's what I've heard. You know our old town hall? Well, rumor has it that they have some kind of special thing that's just like the Destiny Dominus. Ooh, but they're not letting anyone in to look at it. Me? I figure they're waiting to hear from the train or Umpani first. <laughs> just a hunch. Interesting, interesting. Now let's go shopping with her. Um, she has a lot of, of our arrows and bullet stones and stuff like that. Which one should pick up a lot? And you also, if you have an, especially if you have a gadget here, you should pick up all light crossbows that you can buy, because you can later make, if you have like three light crossbows, you can make a triple shot crossbow. Yeah, that can attack three times as much as the normal crossbow, which is just a whole lot. <laughs> and before that, you can even make the double shot crossbow. So we're going to try to do that and also buy some more ammunition if you go overboard um there's always a little bit of uh yeah backlash i can say because so many scrolls there's a lot of weight especially in in bullet stones not so much in quarrels and stuff well their heavy crossbow is also pretty pretty good um there's a there's some uh, special arrows and you get special ammunition from her as well and that's pretty good stuff, but it's too expensive for us now. We can also sell a little bit of stuff. We should actually do that. Let's see what we can do here. Hmm. Yeah, the sweet double is not something that we'll need. Tarnished mail. Just the normal robes, the cloth pans. That's all kind of things that we really don't need like the upper Tosido. We don't have a samurai, so we won't need them. Mm, the pants, cloth shirts, sandals, even more sandals, even more cloth pants, and more sandals. And we also don't really need the Poseur's cap, but it's, yeah, you just take it away. Here we go. We will not give away the tattered note. Come on. All right. So goodbye. We got a lot here, and we can see if we can already do some uh, magic with the crossbows. Like combine them. Ah, doesn't really work yet. I think at fifty it might work, so we can get. Uh, the really cool crossbows, double and triple shot crossbows. So we'll carry them along. Doesn't really matter that they weigh a little bit. We have strong characters with us. Mm. There's something more here that we can search. Yeah, sometimes you randomly find something really, really cool out of out of the blue. That's why. I always check these. 
Because from time to time you and I find something something just new in wizardry. Something I've never seen before. Biscuits. Hey, we're green now. The missile shield. Beautiful. Which means green means that it uh, works basically all the time. Mm. Now let's go to the last shop uh, that we haven't yet visited. Someone pretty cool here. Hello there. Can you see who that is? Yeah, but we'd rather rob him first. A trap. What a nuisance. Yeah, indeed, what a nuisance. We'll just uh, cast a little bit Here. of divine trap and then have a look. And then we'll talk to the nice guy around the corner. Seems like it's poison darts. And we got a skill up just, just like that. ACDC doing great. Especially with the shield now. Is this another 10 bonus for that skill? Another round shield, another all pike. And most importantly, the key card. Um, we've got the ranger here in the back line. He's also got an all pike. All pike is pretty strong because it does so much damage. I think Vi also has an old pike. Or, yeah, an all pike. We just need a little bit of strength to wield that stuff. And later on there will be really, really great spares, which is why we like to train them, especially for the Ranger. That is Anton Rapax. He also got a lot of the resistances. Who have we here? The little galactic explorers. <laughs> oh yes, I heard about you. The Rapax expected someone more formidable, actually. I presume you've come to purchase my weapons and armor. Or perhaps you're looking for a custom piece. Yeah, what about a custom piece? Yes, the custom works are my specialty, but you will find them quite expensive. I could craft for you the Xanarix plate, a steel hide breastplate, or featherweight armor. Or perhaps you prefer a weapon. I have two excellent choices. The Beast Slayer Axe or the Ebon Staff. Of course. You will need to provide me the necessary ingredients. Upon completion, you may then pay me for my work. Yeah, these are all pretty good stuff, and we'll try to pick them up. So we'll just ask them, because then it's going to our journal, and we know in our journal uh, what we need. Yes, a wonderful plate, but created only for the little ones. Fairies, you call them. I will require the following items to complete it. A venom crab shell, a skull from a tomb, and silk from a giant spider. Collect these items and give them to me. So that entries are always then added, and we come back to the steel hide breastplate. And we'll not look, uh, listen to all of that because it's only. Um, later on, for the featherweight armor, I relevant. From a tanpo wasp, a Some of these things, like a gin eye, are only you get only one of these items in the in the game. So these are really, really um, original stuff. Beast the Slayer axe. I require a claw from the piercer Modai, the wide blade of a cleaver. And a single egg from a greater Pecus. When you find these, give them to me. There's also a trick that well, I'll I'll show you because um, uh, now let's go through the Eben stuff. I will be surprised if you can find what I require: a staff from a wood spirit, an Eben gem, and mummy dust. So we also want to trade with him. You've returned. Indeed we have. So you can see he has all kinds of fancy weapons. Expensive and not so expensive. The best things you can get from him is things like this. Specialized, that's Oberon's Grease. That's only for bards. It's really good, but it's only for bards. It has resistances, it has speed bonus. It's armor class bonus. It's just very good. 
So if you buy something from him, buy the only the best of the best. The rest you you will you'll just find. Um, there's also this thing, which is really cool. It's leg armor, and if you've got the spare change, this will help you really, because mainly because of the resistances. But the armor class is also really really good. I've got the nunchaku here, also uh, an extremely good weapon, but only usable by the um, Eastern inspired characters like Ninja and Monk. So, um, apart from the special weapons that you can get from him, these are really good things and you can sell him other things. So that's, a, that's also something that you uh, will learn from all the shops. Not every shop takes, uh, takes the same stuff. There's some shops that will take everything, but they get, give you uh, less good prices for it. So, um, for example, we can sell him like the things like the flail, the sling that we don't need, the battle axe, ha, ah, the enchanted katana, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I mean, we won't use it, so we'll sell it to him. Battle axe, the hatchet, another flail. Let's see, the flail is not usable by the And the quarter staff, the cleavers we want to keep um, for the things you can make with them. And the short, we need a short staff later on to open up a dungeon. So um, there's a short sword that we don't really need. There's some bombs, but these bombs you can use with alchemy to combine them into more powerful things and then sell them and make a huge ton of money or get really great bombs. So. What you can sell is short bows, slings, this this standard things that you get in the in the hundreds or in the thousands. There's really good daggers here, like the poison dagger and things like that. Um, but I really prefer to find what you need along the way. Sometimes you get really cool things uh, that you want to keep keep on you. Um, like an nunchaka is is something. If you have a character of like a, a normal ninja or a monk and these are pretty pretty cool um but we want to make this like the a staff ninja so we don't want that kind of um we don't want that kind of weapon type just because it will uh, uh it will change what we learn and we'd, we'd want to learn one thing so the oberon's greaves here would be really cool so why not buy them? Other than that, the best investment is always spell books, spell books, spell books. But we like our bard and just to demonstrate how great these are. I'll just give them to her and here we go. Uh, now, we need a recipient here for these things. Leather leggings work pretty fine for our elf as well. And the bard, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Got the shields. Got the buckler shield. The round shield has two armor. The buckler shield has one armor. So you can exchange these, as you can see here. There's a difference between them, and I think the round shield is also a little bit lighter. So um, now the the buckler shield is a little bit lighter, and I think it's usable by more classes. That's that. What we want to get, um, White Domina, yeah, we'll give her one of the light crossbows because really, sling and stuff, nah, she's far too good for that. Hmm, yeah, some new bullet stones. This is really the time to refill all that we have. Some more armor here. We'll just fill that in. Ah, oh, we don't want to give Emmanuel too much because he's already in in rather heavy load. So we'll rather take some stuff away from him. Yeah, already getting better. Um, if there's a color here, it's probably bad. There's different uh, times of types of colors. 
until you if you get over the limit here then it's red and it's really really bad for combat but other than that it's 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 really cool here we go and that's why you want some characters to be very very strong right so i'm going to distribute just some uh, healing potions here uh, we've got some light heals here more of them more of them the back line doesn't need so such big things uh front line Thank we want them to have better stuff here we go and later on we can also combine these with alchemy so we also wanted to visit um lord braffitt and heli so why domina can Report back, so to say. Vitalia Domina, it is you I am the most surprised to see. <laughs> it has been a very long time. Oh, it's good to see you, Lord Braffitt. You have no idea how happy I am to be home at last. I am certain you are, girl. You risked your life going with him, you know. Leaving the safe confines of Dominus, traveling through space with a madman, and your eye. What happened to your eye? He took it. I don't know why. I, I tried to fight, but I mean, I'm no match for him. Look, I was young, I was young and foolish. I only thought I was adventurous. He's here. Here on Dominus, you know. Believe me, I know. His henchmen nabbed me before I even made it past the city walls. They locked me up. If it hadn't been for these guys, who knows what he might have done with me. I wish I knew what he wanted with me in the first place. I figured once I got home, I was free of him. None of us are, Vitalia. He has built a tower here and claims it contains enough explosives to destroy all of Arnica. I suggest you be careful. It's he. Trust me. Yeah, he, he needs you for some me reason. For granted, or for anything else. Again. <laughs> and you fellows, you have the thanks of all Arnica for bringing her safely here. And you too should stay clear of the savant. For now, though. I hope to see you again. Till we meet again. Now let's meet up with Heli. Always close doors behind you. Hey, Heli. Well, I don't believe my eyes. Bye! Bye, Domina! My goodness! Heli, I could hardly wait to see you. It has been a long time. Long? I should say so. You said you were leaving for a week. What's it been? Seven years, Heli. Seven long years. What the hell happened, Vi? I mean, there's a lot of difference between seven days and seven years. It's a long story. I've been from one end of the universe to the other. I got a bit more than I bargained for. Did it have to do with, you know, him? The Dark Savant? Yeah. Yeah, it did. I made some foolish choices when I was young, Heli. I never should have left Dominus with him in the first place, but... I can't take it back. He's here, Vi. Here on Dominus. At least that's the word I'm getting in here. Did you know that? It's why we came back. Hell, I wasn't here two days before his troopers already had me. These guys came to my rescue. I can tell you all about it when things settle down. But first, let's get some drinks for me and my friends. On the house, Vi. This'll hit the spot. Thanks, Heli. Sure thing. Wonderful. That's how quests are here, right? Someone says you something and you can go there. Mm -hmm. And it's also usually somewhere in the journal, but it's not like you have a not not a like a something blinking on the map or something I'll like see that. You when you get back. Farewell. Yeah, farewell and uh until next time, dear friends and deep thinkers. 
next time we're gonna go deeper into the secrets of Anika some really cool items that are hidden here and uh, yeah just something more to discover probably the rest of Anika except except maybe the sealed tower except maybe the strange spaceport or maybe these as well we'll see have a great time until then and happy gaming this is Immanuel Khan signing out see you soon and happy gaming